The sailing ship, the Tempest, is caught in a violent storm. The wind howls and the sea roars. The ship rocks violently and the crew struggles to maintain control. Captain Jack, shouting over the storm. Hold fast, everyone! This storm's a monster! Up to this point, if you wanted to make an AI video like this, you had two choices. Pika Labs, which is free but restricts the video length to 3 seconds, and Runway ML, which is very expensive. Now, you have another choice. Stay to the end, I will show you how to do longer videos for free. Step 1, you will need to get a script and voiceover for your short movie. Head over to ChatGPT. Enter this prompt. Now we have a nice script. Now you could copy all of this, but I will just copy the first part as a test. Head over to 11labs.io with the link in the description. Sign up for a free account and paste in the script. Before we generate it, keep the settings as default, you can play with these later. Go ahead and generate it, it will play automatically. The sailing ship, the tempest is caught in a violent storm. The wind howls and the sea roars. The ship rocks violently and the crew struggles to maintain control. Step 2. Let's create AI videos. Head over to Morph Studio with the link in the description. Here are some benefits of Morph Studio. First, it produces high definition clips. It is free, at least for now, I don't know how long that will last. There is no credit card required and it can create videos up to 7 seconds in length. Scroll down to see some examples created with this tool. Click the link to join the beta. This will ask you if you want to launch Discord, you can cancel that pop-up and hit continue to open it in the browser. You may have to register for Discord if you have not used it before. It is free. First, head over to the tutorial channel on the left menu. Here you will find useful instructions. All prompts start with the video keyword, then you can specify your prompt in simple English. Next, you can specify the aspect ratio, the motion speed, the camera actions, the frames per second, and the length in seconds. Below that, you see an example prompt. Then you can see below the possible values for each. For aspect ratio, you can use these options. The default is 16 to 9. For motion, you can specify a value between 1 to 10. The higher the value, the more motion you will see. The default is 5. The camera motion can be specified with any of these settings. The frames per second can be set from 8 to 30 and the default is 24. Finally, seconds of the video length can be specified between 3 to 7. Next, head over to a generation channel and try a basic prompt and watch the video it creates. It will take a moment. Not bad. You can download the video by clicking this button. You can remix the prompt and adjust it by hitting this button. Let's set the length to 7 seconds and add some camera motion. And play it. Nice. Download it. Step 3. Let's put it all together with an editor. Download and open CapCut, which is a popular editor you have seen me use on my channel. Check those videos for more tips on its use. Drag in our videos and voiceover. Now, add the voiceover to the timeline by hitting the plus button. Then start adding the clips.
Let's add some music. Go to Audio Menu and search for Dramatic. Reset the playhead and insert the music there. Now, move the playhead to the end of the voiceover and hit the split button to trim up the music. You can delete the extra part by selecting it and hitting the delete key. Let's lower the music volume. Next, select and trim the extra video. Then, let's add some special effects. Reset the playhead to the beginning and from the effects menu, search for rain. Apply this effect and extend it to cover the entire range of our video. OK, let's play our video to check it out. The sailing ship The Tempest is caught in a violent storm. The wind howls and the sea roars. The ship rocks violently and the crew struggles to maintain control. Captain Jack shouting over the storm. Hold fast, everyone. This storm's a monster. Now for the next steps. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notify button so you don't miss my upcoming content. Take a moment to drop me a comment, tell me how I am doing and let me know any content you want to see. Check out our other videos on using AI to make money online. Until next time, bye bye.